Explain actual cycles. In the fuel-air cycle, we consider the following assumptions. Following these assumptions, we get the theoretical efficiency for an engine. However, in actual practice, the efficiency achieved by an engine is less than its theoretical efficiency. This is because we cannot follow these assumptions practically. Hence, we need to analyze the fuel-air cycle under actual conditions and this practical analysis is known as actual cycles. Thus, we can define actual cycle as the practical cycle which takes air-fuel mixture as the working fluid under the actual conditions and considers the losses incurred due to them. The factors influencing the efficiency of the actual cycle are Time loss factor In the actual compression ignition engine, when the fuel is injected, some time is required for the mixing of the fuel. This loss is known as time loss due to air-fuel mixing. Also, in the IC engine, when the combustion takes place, it takes place over a definite period of time which causes the loss of efficiency. This loss is known as time loss due to progressive combustion. Heat loss factor In the actual engine, during compression, and power stroke. The transfer of heat to the cylinder walls takes place which causes the heat losses which reduce the efficiency of the engine. Exhaust blowdown factor. In the actual engine, if the exhaust valve is open at BDC, the piston has to do work against high cylinder pressure. To reduce this, the exhaust valve is opened a little bit before the piston reaches BDC which then suddenly reduces the pressure of the chamber and thus a part of expansion stroke is lost which reduces the work and thus the efficiency of the engine is reduced. Due to these losses, the actual cycle of an IC engine, say SI engine, on PV diagram is different from the fuel air cycle and can be shown as here region 1 represents the time loss. Region 2 represents the heat loss and region 3 represents the exhaust loss. Related term is 